we're doing is um, at Porter County Parks, we've had a, the vision of building a natural playground out at Sunset Hill. And which, what a natural playground or a natural play environment, as they're sometimes called, is is something that incorporates natural materials from the area to create a learning environment and a play area where kids can go out. And to them, it's play, but it's also an educational um, atmosphere where they're learning about native species, they're learning about um, the history of the area, um, and that's what this particularly is for, is for the Native American installment of our natural playground, which is going to be the first phase of what's going to be a larger playground out at Sunset Hill. Um, so for this particular project, we've been selected by the National Recreation and Park Association to be part of their crowdfunding campaign called Fund Your Park. We're one of 10 national organizations, or 10 organizations nationally that have been selected. So it's really exciting for us to get this opportunity to put this vision out there nationally to hopefully raise, our goal is to raise $25,000 to get this first installment of the play area going at Sunset Hill. important to Porter County Parks because one of the things we try to do is not only give um, families and local children and just community members a place where that's accessible within the community to come and get active and exercise and be fit and play but it's also very important for our programming because this will serve as not only a place for them to get active but it'll also serve as an educational facility on the property. It'll um, as I said before, it'll have those historical elements where kids, while they're playing, will be learning about people that lived in this area long before we did. They'll be learning about the natural environment that makes up Sunset Hill. So it's really um, a multifaceted project that'll give people opportunities to get involved in nature in all different ways. One of the reasons we think people will be interested in donating to this project is because it's, it's, for, it's the first of its kind in Porter County. We haven't had a natural playground facility like this and it's really, it's something that everyone can use. It's not something that's targeted at a certain population or age group. I mean, this is something we've worked with um, Opportunity Enterprises and Club Wonder. We've worked with parents as teachers. We've pulled in local community members to really create a project that has something for everyone, for little kids, for big kids, for families for schools, for teachers, all different members of the communities are gonna find a use in this project. So we really hope that people will see that as part of it and contribute to the campaign because we really think it'll be an asset in the community um, in terms of health and wellness, fitness, education, tourism, economic development. We really think it's gonna be a pull for all those different factors. And it'll run for 45 days. It's fundyourpark.org. When you visit fundyourpark.org, our campaign will be one of the 10 that shows up and you're able to go right there on our page and contribute to the project. You can find info about the parks on our Facebook page, which is just Porter County Parks and Recreation. We'll also be starting um, a few different social media pages called Fun Sunset, which are for this part are for this project in general. So you can find information there or you can visit www.portercountyparks.org. And any and all contributions, whether it's a dollar to a thousand dollars to a million dollars, we'll take anything to make the project happen.